of my favorite walks. I'm going to be out there today. Wish me luck. Eleven through fifteen, first target. Fourteen fifteen. And I noticed the VDI on yesterday's gold ring was a fourteen fifteen. Pull tab, first target. iffy signal it's like 13 to 20 but it's repeatable five to twenty three to twenty with a slight grunt I hear some grunting in there Figures I don't bring the longer handle today. There we go. Actually, like finding sinkers, guys. You know, when you find the sinkers, there's gold. Not always, but it's close to it. Solid 20. Most likely a zinkin. Super shallow, that's always good. Makes it easy. Makes it easy. It's up 14, 15. Loud. Five nine zero fifteen. Two through nine, third scoop. Says I got it. Pull tab. First thirty. A two scooper. That's a good color. Solid ten. Great sound, exactly where you'd want to want to find it. Solid ten. Still solid ten. It's got like a chirpier edge to it, though. A uh, louder sound. Third scoop. Uh. I just found another piece of can. I'm getting on a can corner where there's a lot of pieces of can, but that was a great sound right there. It's uh, 20 to 22. These are the sounds, guys. If you're just looking for gold, you could really li leave this with the, with the Equinox. So now it's a negative five to 24. Chirpy, 
just loud sound. It's going to be a sinker or a Lincoln. Sounds all negative in the hole, so I'm going to just check before I dump it out. So it's still in the hole. There was the chirp again. These are, they could easily be a deep can as well. Super deep. This is where you really need the long handle. But I shouldn't even be digging this because it's not going to be gold. I like it because sometimes it's a, you know an old silver ring, and it's in sand that is almost impossible to pull up out. solid 13 out of the hole. Either that or there was a number 13 up here. This is a solid 13. I'm thinking this is a different signal and I'm digging in a different hole. You dig these 13s all day long. <laughs> I'll never leave a solid 13 like this ever. And then I'll go back in that hole and maybe see if I find that. Uh... So this definitely wasn't. This definitely wasn't the chirpy, chirpy thing over here. So I'm gonna have to check this out. See if it's still in the hole. Corona. I got the Corona at the beach. Be a fresh drop. No, sir. It's a pinky. <laughs> loud, loud 20. Like a fresh drop penny. Definitely a fresh drop penny. Penny, penny, penny. Penny, penny. Penny, penny, penny. I'm hoping it's a diamond ring. <laughs> oh, now I hear some negative to it. So now it sounds more like a bling earring or sunglasses, maybe? Oh. I'll take a little... Saint for the day. Wow, that would be cool if it was gold. It looks just so shiny. It's so light, there's no way it's gold, but it's a ring. Let's put it on. Guided by the Saints, guys. Uh, and listen, there's a lot of uh, stingrays, guys, so shuffle your feet if you're coming to Pinellas County.
pull tab. Look at the size of that snook. It's a big snook right there. It's about 20, 20 plus inches long. Nice snook. Solid 13, 14. It's allowed. It's going to be a pull tab. And 90% of the 13, 99% of the 13, 14s you pull are uh, going to be pull tabs. And then, yes, that's 90. Actually, I should go 999 out of a thousand are going to be pull tabs. Or nickel. Or a pull tab. <laughs> Whatever it was just fell back in the hole. It was probably a <laughs> probably a pull tab the whole time. Yeah. One of these pull tabs the whole time. That's crazy deep for that stupid pull tab. It's a grunty 14. It's probably a bottle cap or a or a sinker. Or a piece of aluminum. But the water's been so cold that uh, nobody wants to go out very deep. And now the low tide's at noon, 